Welcome to NITEC. Our NITEC Knows video today is on NovaSign's Novatizer. My name is Eric and I'm with NITEC and today I'm going to show you the all new Novatizer um, by NovaSign. Uh, this product is new to the industry and has become a a very necessary product with everything going on in the market right now and everything going on in the world. This is how they come from overseas. Oh, this entire unit is covered with a with a protective piece of plastic that peels off from the top down and the screen has a protective piece of plastic. So this is what comes in the bag, the bag that looks like this. You're gonna have some quick instructions. It's gonna show you, you know, how to, to take the tank out, how to fill it with sanitizer. It's gonna show you um, how to use the keys that come with it to lock it. It's gonna show you how to dispense. Comes with a warranty card. Fill this out, turn it in, follow the instructions, take advantage of your warranty. Um, comes with the remote. You'll notice when it comes out of the box, if you try to use it, it will not work. It has one of those little plastic pull tabs to get the batteries touching and, and working. So this is the remote. Comes with a set of keys. Um, you may get the question, are these keys unique to the unit? The answer is no. Any keys will open any unit. So just know that they're not unique to the unit. Comes with an antenna for Wi-Fi. Um, and I'm gonna go over the connectivity of this unit in a minute. As you guys can kind of see here, what it comes with to mount onto the wall is not the best solution. It's just a couple drywall screws and some drywall plugs. We've got it mounted that way here um, and it, it's sturdy. But if you're gonna put it into your bar, restaurant, museum, anything like that, we highly recommend um, going with a more robust mount. This is a peerless mount. Um, this piece goes on the wall. This piece connects to this piece um, and you have a much more secure uh, way to secure the, the Novatizer onto the wall. I highly recommend this method. Um, and these are fairly inexpensive. So last but not least, it comes with, with this drip tray. So um, it usually comes as two pieces. You'll see one of these or two of these in the box. This is just a little, little bottom that goes in there and you get the drip tray. Um, that's everything in the bag. So that is the external of the unit. You'll see here, this is your, your IR relay right there. Um, that's where you're gonna catch your remote control frequencies to, to change when I get into the, the inside and the media player that's built into this. So, okay, to open the Novatizer, this is how you do it. You take the tray out, take your keys that came with your unit, unlock it, and slide the hood open. It pops open, just like the hood of a car, it's got a stand here. And it's got a couple little pieces of plastic that this stand sits in, if you can see this. And you set it down here, just like the hood of a car, and it stays open. You're going to need to prime it a few times. You're going to hear it go off. Put your hand under it like this a few times. Nothing is going to come out until uh, the, you know, the sanitizer makes its way through the nozzle and, and out the end. And the lifetime of pumps for this unit is 650,000 pumps. There's a little reset button right here. Um, if you're ever having a problem or you need to reset it, it's stuck in the closed position, you would hit that button and it would reset. You simply pull the, pull the tank out like that. It's very simple. There's nothing locking it in place. This is the tank right here. You can see that the top pops open. It's got a little hole in the top like that. You can see there, a little sanitizer. And you fill it and you simply close it again. Uh, this nozzle is removable. I'll remove it right now. This is the liquid sanitizer tip, and I'll show you the difference. So you're going to kind of see two different tips. This one with the spring in it, 
That's the, the tip that comes with the unit that's already on the tank when you receive the unit. And in a bag in the box will be this additional unit. This is the liquid foaming sanitizer tip. So if you're gonna use liquid foam sanitizer, this is the tip that you would use. There's a little kind of a piece of plastic and metal sticking out. It's a sensor or it sets the sensor off. This needs to be guided um, up here. You can see a channel. That's gonna, that's gonna tell this, this dispensing mechanism that the tank is in. Uh, the, the measuring pieces here or the measuring lines here, those are gonna go face in and you're just gonna line up You get the little little metal plastic nodule there. You can see the cap fits in here. And then you wanna make sure that this piece of the nozzle is above the dispensing piece. If it's not, you push it back in. You're gonna kinda of see a light flashes up there. That's just saying, oh, we sense the tank is back in and now you're good to go. Okay, so I'm gonna go over the remote a little bit now. Uh, this is the, there, there, as you can see, there's a lot of options on this remote. You can see the power home, menu, mute. There's a way to toggle an internet browser. Uh, there's left, right, up, down, and okay. Um, you've got your volume up and down, your return button, your tab button, all your numbers. And then at the bottom here, you have VOD, live, pause, and play. So you can see it's the remote pretty much has everything you're gonna need on it. This is the home screen. So you're gonna see here, you've got a few different options. You've got applications, settings, favorites, file browser and web browser. I'm gonna take you in to applications. This is where the NovaSign software sits, it resides, uh, and you can see a lot of other applications on here. This is where you can add or remove applications depending on what you're doing uh, and what kind of, of applications that you'd like to use with this unit. Settings is the second one. Uh, you can see this is just all of your Android media player settings all of your system settings from Wi-Fi, data usage, all the way down, you know, all your, your storage apps, uh, date, time, language, uh, pretty much everything uh, that's on an Android media operating system. This is where you would connect your Wi-Fi or your, your hardwire internet connection. And then you've got favorites here. This is just where you would store your favorite files if you want a quick access. Next, you've got your file browser. So this is where if you wanna pull any video files from anywhere else, like a USB stick, um, from the internet, from, from your, your local area network, this is where you would do it. You can, kind of, you can see up the top left is device. So you've got file, music, picture, video, and device. So this is where you would choose your device. You know, you got video files, picture files, music files, and then you've got file. And you can see I just selected file um, and it, it's, this is where your files would be if they were on the memory of the media player. Okay, we're back to the home screen now. The last uh, feature here is web browser. If you wanted to use a web browser or get anything off a of web browser or use it to connect, uh, that's where you would do it. This sticker, we've had some customers ask, can I remove the sticker? Yes, you can remove the sticker. You can make this clean white. We also offer, um, we can wrap them for you. So if you want to put your logo on this, if you want to wrap the entire thing with your corporate colors, your product colors, whatever it is, uh, we can do that for you for an additional fee. So thank you everyone for watching this awesome video. This is the Novatizer by NovaSign. If you have any questions, you need pricing, uh, availability. Uh, there's a lot of demand for this unit in the market right now. Give us a call. Um, our sales line is 866-469-7111 or email sales at nitech.com. I'm Eric. This is the Novatizer. Nitech out.